How's it going everybody on YouTube? I'm back at it again with another video and in this video I'm going to sneak into Crawford. If you guys have not seen the last video, I'll link it at the top right corner, put it at the bottom of the description and let's get straight into this. Check out what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Might come in handy on this little break-in. Nice. Can I talk to you a minute? What's up? I took another look at the boat. She's a 30-footer. So? So we're gonna have a capacity problem. Boat that size ain't gonna hold more than five people, even with one of them a kid. Me, you, Clem, Krista, Omi, Ben, Molly. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, that's still one too many. Even if we cut Molly loose. Before this is over, we're gonna have to make a decision. You're not serious. Look, I'm just saying, if we want the best chance of... Who the hell is this? This is Bree. She can help us. Help us how? I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. I know the layout. With her help, we're in and out faster. Anyone have a problem with that? I guess not. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. Looks like she's gonna help us now. Hold up just a sec. You understand why you have to stay behind, don't you? I guess. Plus you have a job to do. An important job. I need you to stay here and watch over the house. Watch over Omid. Well, what should I do if something happens while you're gone? Hmm. I'm gonna give her the here. gun. I want you to take this. You remember how to use it, don't you? It's just like I showed you. I remember. So if anyone tries to get inside the house that isn't one of us, or if something does happen to Omid... I know what to do. Let's get you inside. I think I should have brought her with me. Instead of just leaving her here. That's a creepy-ass house, guys. Let's get this over with. This should be it. We're right underneath the center of Crawford. The old school should be directly above us. Okay, people. This is it. Remember the plan. We stay quiet, we stay hidden, and we stay together. We find what we need, and we get the hell out before anyone even knows we're there. Got it? All right. Let's go inside Crawford. We're gonna sneak in, guys. Let's go. So this is Crawford. Is everybody? There should be guards patrolling. What? Are you disappointed? It's just strange, is all. I think I see one over there by the door. Okay. Me and Kenny will sneak up, try to take him out quiet. The rest of you wait for our signal, then follow us over. Everybody got it? Okay, Kenny, let's do this quiet. No shooting unless there's no other choice. Right behind you. Okay, let's take this guy out. Zombie, what the hell? What the fuck is a walker doing inside here? Get inside, fast! Do you 
think they saw us? Your guess is as good as mine. Shit! What the hell happened here? I thought this place was supposed to be secure. What always happens, I guess. In the end, the dead always win. Oh man, we are so screwed. No, this is good. Of course Ben is gonna freak out. What? How the fuck is this good? Before, everyone at Crawford was smart and they had guns. Now they're dumb and they don't. Hey, trying to look on the bright side here. I agree. So long as we don't let him box us in, we can still do this. The plan hasn't changed. The plan hasn't changed? Every time walkers show up, the plan changes. Do you even have any idea how many of them are out there? No. You want to do a head count? Or do you want to get what we need and get the hell out of here? Come on. I think I know which way to head. I got a bad feeling about this. Scared Ben. He's always so scared. He's always worried about everything. Just keep moving. Here. Looks okay. Everybody in. like they were using this room as some kind of command center. Okay, so now what? Where do we start looking? Here. Just give me a sec. Idea where we could find a battery? Maybe at the auto shop. There used to be one in the alley outside the fire escape. Yep, it's called Herman's. You can't miss it. Okay, let's. What about fuel? Where can we find some fuel for the boat? There's a maintenance shed across from the playground here. If they were storing fuel, that's probably where it'll be. She has some big fingers. What about the Damn. Right here, nurse's station. They were using it as a medical facility. How do you know that? Just makes sense, doesn't it? Okay, I'll make the run to the maintenance shed for the fuel. It'll be faster if I go with you. I can take you right to it. I'll come too. No, two people's enough. You stay here, see if you can use any of those tools we brought to get that armory door open. We might need to shoot our way out of here. I'll go for the medicine. I'll come with you. I know what to take. Okay. Guess that leaves me to go find us a battery. I'll go with you. Watch your back. Okay, we've got a plan. Oh, good. Everyone be careful. Stay close to one another. We'll all meet back here. Good luck. Okay, so I'm just gonna go get a battery by myself. Okay. Hopscotch. All right, what am I doing here? I'm getting off track. Uh, what is Ben doing? Hey, you need any help with that? Thanks, I got it. Just once, I'd like to do something useful, you know? 
Hmm. You're plenty useful. Huh. Yeah, right. Seems like all I ever do is get us into trouble. Yeah, you do. Well, I'll let you get on with it. No, wait. There is something you can help me with. Something that's been on my mind. I could use your opinion. What is it? It's Kenny. Since I've been helping him work on the boat, I've gotten to know him a little better. He's a good guy, you know? And it's eating me up knowing what I know. I've been thinking about telling him the truth. Ben, come on. This again? It's my fault Duck and Katja got killed. If I hadn't screwed up back at the motor inn, they'd still be alive. How am I supposed to just carry something like that around? I have to tell him. I agree. I think you should tell him. Just not now. You don't get it, Lee. What am I supposed to do whenever he talks about Katja and Duck? Just nod and pretend like it wasn't my fault. I can't do it anymore. Ben, listen. Kenny seems like he's got his shit back together because right now he's got a purpose. But he's still in a real bad place. You tell him now, oh, he's Lee's right. It, and then we're all screwed. There'll come a time when he's ready to hear it. But it's not now. Not yet. I hear you. I'm gonna get back to this. Yeah, Lee is 100% right. If Ben tells Kenny what the heck happened back there at the uh, hotels. Oh my goodness. Kenny is going to freak out all over Ben. He might even kill him. Oh crap. The oh, so there's the Molly. Auto shops down here. You coming or not? I thought she was a zombie for a second. I thought she left me. Can this I go through here? The way to the playground where Bree said the fuel was being stored. Hasn't been much time. Okay, I cannot go Better through there. Can he do their thing. That's just something that's very complacent that I can click on. There's a lot of stuff to look at. Look, can I look in the locker? I'm gonna look in the locker real quick, guys. Can't open it without the combination. This was a Logan's locker. It says it right there. I don't know if you guys could see it. I'm gonna look at these names real quick. We got, we got, uh, Her Herman. We got Banks. We got Longley. What the hell are these names? Okay. Wait, wh who's this? Must be the guy who ran this place. Looks like he figured himself as some kind of supreme leader. Okay, so he is basically the president of Crossford. This must be the door to the alleyway where the auto shop is. But where the hell is Molly? Molly, you out here? So I'm not going that way. Heck no, I'm not gonna go that way. There's zombies. I'm gonna go this way. What's that? Auto shop must be down this way. Oh, what the hell? Oh my gosh. Who is that? Who the hell was that? I better not get jump scared. Can I jump up there? Oh, nice. Okay. From this point of view, I don't feel as scared. Because I don't feel like something is going to jump scare me. Damn. Jam tight. <laughs> Better not get too close. Oh, my gosh. Leave 
him! He's mine. What were you doing up there? Molly? <laughs> Molly! What? What the hell do you think you're doing? It's dead already. I think you can lay off. Don't tell me what to do. You kill geeks your way, I'll kill him mine. Damn. He's wearing medical scrubs. Some kind of scientist or doctor, maybe? Yeah, well, he ain't shit now. <sighs> Did you find us a way in? Yeah, but the garage door's jammed. Can't raise it. Not a problem. Look what I found. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. That'll work. Take a look around. I'll make sure no stragglers get under this door. No power. All right, let's go through here. Nope. Locked. Can't no go through there. Him. All right. Where is a battery? Let's look up here. I can't reach it up there. Oh, there's got to be a switch somewhere. I could bring this down. There's got to be something. Oh, wait, I could use this. No power. No power? Looks like it's the hose for the lift hydraulics. Okay, how do I turn on the power? Okay. Let's talk to Molly, see if she knows anything. Something you need? Hmm. Think I can borrow that uh, hook thing of yours? I don't know. Hilda and I have been through a lot together. Hilda? That's what I call her. Don't judge. Please, can I borrow Hilda? I'll take good care of her. She won't get a scratch. I got your promise now. Not a scratch. I don't know what the hell I just did, guys. I did oh, it. that's what that does. Whoa, whoa. That's probably not good. No shit! Wow. I'll try to hold him off. Hurry! There's the battery. Finally something goes right. Still attached to the terminals. Still attached to the terminals. Still attached to the terminals. There we go. Got that one off! Yeah, we got it off. It's off. Finally. Got it. Yeah, but we still got a problem here. Put it in here, I'll carry it. Okay, follow me. Move your ass! All right, all right, I'm moving, I'm moving. Great, now what? Skylight. Okay, let's jump up. Shot. Shoot it out! Alright. Okay. 
say so. Now we're on a roof. Do you ever stop complaining? Come on. Come on, what are you, chicken? Jump! What did you call me? Well, now that you mention it... Grab! There we go. Nice. We're safe. For now. Come on. Later. Something I gotta do first. What? Catch you later. Wait, you still got the battery? Yeah, I think I'll hold on to it. Make sure you don't leave without me. See you back in class. Molly! God damn it, what the hell is she doing? Okay, can I talk to these people? You guys need any help? Thanks, but I think we're almost in. We're taking care of it, Lee. Don't worry. All right, I guess they don't need help. Wait a minute. You sure you two don't need any help? We're taking care of it, Lee. Don't worry. What the? They're just looking at a door. I hope they're not glitched out. I really do. I don't want to have to restart my game. Can I go through here? I'm going back out there unless I have a damn good reason. No, oh, Lee's right. Yeah, I'm definitely right. Wait, what's what's over here? Nothing? Okay. All right. Let's just keep roaming around till we find something good. What's this? Little help! Little help here! Just yet. Let's get the hell back to the classroom. Give us a hand with these fuel cans. They weigh a goddamn ton. Hey, how'd you guys make out? We got the fuel. Awesome. Good job, guys. How you doing with that door? Not so good. Here, let me give you a hand. Did you get that battery yet? Yeah, Molly has it. She should be back here soon. She'd better be. Oh my gosh, Molly's gonna hold us up. What do we still need? We already got the fuel and the battery. Once we find some medicine, we'll be good to go. So where's this battery you found? Molly has it. She ran off to do something. Well, she'd better bring it back here. I don't know why you trusted that girl with it. We hardly know her. She saved your life, didn't she? <laughs> yeah, but what has she done for me lately? Okay, they're just gonna figure out how to open that door. Let's see, can I go back out here? Oh, I can. Okay. Let's go figure out what that was. What is this? 
fired. They're worthless. Okay. Shit. Where the heck did they come from? Kristen Vernon must be trapped in there. Okay. That was easy. What the hell happened? They wandered into the hallway after we got inside. I think they must have heard us rooting around in here. The whole place is infested. They're everywhere. Calm down. I took care of them. What about the mids? Did we find what we need? Yeah, that's our other problem. Take a look. Looks like they were keeping all the prescription meds in that safe, locked up tight. There's no way we can bust it open? Maybe with enough time, but I don't know how much of that we have. Be a hell of a lot quicker if we just knew the four-digit combination. Well, I doubt they just wrote it down and left it here for us to find. We should just try busting it open. We don't have any other choice. Okay, you get started. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. Okay, let's try to look for the uh, combination. Just a bunch of papers. No safe combination, though. Maybe it's in the desk or right here. Anna Correa. Guess she must have been a patient here. And what's this? Phones probably haven't worked in months. What's that over there? How's it coming? Slow. Too slow. I'm worried that by the time we manage to get this thing open, it may be too late. Molly helped me get the battery we needed. That's great. One down. Where is she? She took off. Had some kind of errand she needed to run. Took off? With the battery? Yeah. Don't worry. She'll be back. I hope so. That girl doesn't really strike me as a team player. More the mercenary kind. I'll go see if I can find something that'll help us get that safe open. Good idea. Yeah, I'm gonna go continue to look. Y'all already checked these drawers? Yes, Lee. Nothing in there worth taking. Okay. What's this? There's dried blood on this printout. And on the floor. Looks like a trail of it from the safe to the camera over there. Then out the door. What the hell happened here? I'm gonna follow that. Okay, let's follow this trail. Why does my camera look like this? Oh, I can't follow the trail? What the heck? I, I guess I'm just gonna go back inside. All right. Why, why is there a blood trail? Why did that need to be why did, why did, how was that a thing? Vernon, Krista, come look at this. This is day 82 since the outbreak, 1547. Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh God, oh God, oh God. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. 
But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I could see old evidence for a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I'm gonna give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. I don't want the procedure! I want my baby! I can't do this! I can't do this! Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later than tomorrow. Or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. There she goes. Damn it, we almost had it. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. Lee, maybe there's another tape. We gotta keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers out in the alley by the auto shop. Maybe you should search it, see what he's got on him. So am I gonna go back out there? Okay, I'm gonna go back out there, guys. I have a feeling that I'm gonna get jump scared out there. Can I not go this way? Okay, good. I'm gonna walk all the way back to the auto shop to go search that doctor. Am I even going the right way? No, I'm not. Right. Okay, let's walk all the way back. And we're gonna turn left here. Oh no, right. We're gonna turn right. Okay, here we go. Here's the exit. Let's go search that walker. I swear if this guy out here, this freaky dude, scares me. The one that was like in the last video that- Oh shit! What the hell? Think you're going? Come back here. Where the hell do you think you're going? I stomped the shit out of him. Damn. Okay, we got the tape. Nice. This might be just what we need. And what's this? Looks like some kind of code. But Vernon said the safe combination was only four numbers. Shit, time to go. Found another tape. This one's dated October 10th. That's the day after the first one we watched. Put it in. Have you made a decision? I thought you said I didn't have a choice. Well, technically you do. You can terminate the pregnancy or leave Crawford. Of course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. Maybe that's best. I stayed up all last night thinking about this. Why are we even trying to survive? To keep on living, if this is what it takes. If this is what it's turned us into. I don't make the rules, Anna. 
Doctor, I'm begging you, please help me. Maybe one day when things are different, you can try again. But for now, today, we have to do this. Oh my gosh. No. No. I think we know what happened to Crawford. More importantly, we got the combination. Krista, are you all right? What's wrong? It's nothing. That was just hard to watch. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. All right. Let's get those meds and get the hell out of here. Finally, we're in business. Antibiotics, we got the meds. morphine. We'll take as much of this as we can carry. Okay, I think we're good. This is more than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. You go on ahead. I want to make sure we didn't miss anything. I'll be right behind you. Don't take too long. Okay, what did we miss? Why am I looking around? I'll have to take time to rest later, I think. Hold on. Wait a minute. I think... No, never mind. Am I gonna stay in this room and just look around? What's... what's this? What is this? A copy machine. Not that it matters with no power around here. What am I going to do with a copy machine? Okay. There's really nothing to do. In that room. And- oh wait, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. I could open this. Logan. This must have been his locker. A videotape? You guys already know what I'm about to do. I'm about to go watch this. Let's see what's on this videotape. Listen, as fun as this was, I have to put a stop to this little arrangement. This is the last I can give you. Why? Oberson had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. He's really cracking down. I just can't risk it. We had a deal. Yes, we had a deal. We don't anymore. My sister needs this medicine. Without it, she'll die or she'll start showing symptoms and they'll take her away. I can't let that happen. I'm sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Yeah, that's the Crawford way, isn't it? That's crazy. Well, shit. Well, that's good to know. I guess he deserved it, after all. Let's go back, guys. Well, what the hell? Jesus Christ! Oh, you scared the shit out of me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. I'll take that battery down. Oh, yeah. Uh, about that. I'm just kidding. Okay, good. Here you go. I was actually starting to get irritated, guys. What's that? Nothing. 
You lied to me. What? You said you'd never been here before, but that wasn't the truth, was it? What? Who told you that? I saw you on a security tape. You were having an affair with that doctor. Hey, from what I've heard, you're not real big on the truth yourself. Besides, I didn't lie. I asked you how you knew about Crawford. You said you just heard stories. I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You saved my life twice, but you can't tell me the truth? Are we really gonna do this now? I guess that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. She was 14 years old. I just want to go on the boat, when bro. When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place or in their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic, and by Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. I kept it a secret. Kept her safe for as long as I could, but in the end, I couldn't protect her. That's when I got out. Crawford, they always talked about how their system worked. How anything was better than becoming one of them. But I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late. Before they came and took my sister away. This is all I have left of her. I didn't have time to take it before I got out of Crawford. I just wanted it, okay? I don't care about your life story, Molly. Then maybe you shouldn't have asked. It's just that me and my people, we, we got our own problems, you know? Yeah, well, who doesn't these days? What the hell? I think that's our cue to get the hell out of here. Sorry, I just got spooked by those bells, and then I heard someone coming. What the fuck are you doing out here? Kenny and I still can't get the door open to the armory. He sent me out to look for something we can use to bust it open. I found this. Uh, Ben? Where did you get that? I just found it. It was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway back there. Oh no. Thank me later. Come on! Ben, we gotta go! Ben! Move your ass! What the fuck is going on? They're coming. Oh, shit. That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. Come on, damn you! This is my fault, all my fault. What the hell's he babbling about? Ben, we talked about this. No, wait, I want to know what he meant. What do you mean this is all your fault? Kenny, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, save it for later. Ben, shut the fuck up. Fuck you, Lee, I can't do this anymore. It's been me all along, putting all of us in danger. Katja and Duck, it was all me. It was all me. Oh. Wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the Motor Inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck... Kitty man, I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. I gotta focus on getting out of here. You little pisshead! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dead! My wife and child! You gotta both fucking kill! Kenny, listen to me. You can whoop his skinny little ass later. But right now, we gotta go! Nice group you got here. Not the time, Molly. If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! 
You hear me, shitbird? You can stay behind and fucking rot! Kenny, we'll sort this out later. After we get out of here, okay? Ain't nothing to sort out. I just told you the way it's gonna be. The boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's gotta get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here! Well, I vote we leave it. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well. But all I want to do is get back to Omi, and you put that at risk. I can't do this right now. I abstain. We'll figure this out later. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a second? <laughs> Now can we go? Damn right. Vernon, come on! So much for the armory. What's left of it? A few rounds. That's it. You didn't close that door behind us? I couldn't. The lock was busted. Great. Just fucking great. Come on! There's gotta be a way out down here! <laughs> Fuck! It's not gonna hold. Back upstairs! Lee, look! find a way down from there. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? Yeah. Why? Never mind. I can see the sewer where we came in from here. I think we can do this. Well, what are we waiting for? Go, go! Come on, let's go! guys that's gonna be it for part 12 i hope you guys did enjoy it i will be back at it again soon with another video a part 13 so stay tuned for that make sure you guys subscribe 
and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching.